Hello, I cleaned just for you all. Welcome to the behind the scenes of Michaela's studio. Studio being my room or whatever space I can find. This is me, hello. <laughs> it's in the last year that I started becoming a little more serious about my art. Um, so I'm starting my first series called Nigga in Blue. You can see on the wall there, it's all about black mental health from my perspective. The hopes to start conversation around mental health more um, seriously. So a few of the pieces I've been working on get a little messy. So I go out to my extended studio to not get carpets dirty. Um, and working on stuff like this mannequin head, hollowing it out to later cry for my series. Um, I prefer to work in my room because I've set up the space with music and incense and just vibes um, that make me want to do more creative things. And typically I'm busy with school as a Georgia Tech student. So when I have time and feel creative, I like to take full advantage and work on multiple things at a time. Um, so one or two pieces may be drawing while I make edits to an old one or start something new that I've been thinking about. My garage is a good place for that. Um, my mom is also an artist and we've accumulated a lot of random junk um, that we use for sculpture pieces or to set up spaces so we can work on other pieces. But it's just a lot of electronics and random doodads. I draw a lot of inspiration from Jean-Michel. Um, his process and his style, um, I've found a home in him in that sense. And he's made me really hone into who I am as an artist and my confidence levels there. I can really attribute my last year to him. It's made me more patient to like look at my art and I mean really look at it and revisit the vision that I initially had because um, sometimes I can rush that. And so I don't have much else to say. This is my little key studio. I appreciate you all stopping by. Until next time, stay safe out there. Talk to you later.